What's up, everybody? My name is Matt Roden, here for Broadway.com at the opening night of Bandstand on the Broadway. And tonight I will not be asking anyone real questions because we are playing a game that I like to call Swing and a Miss. I'm going to give you swing time terms and phrases. Okay. And you're going to tell me what they mean. Beat up the chops. Beat up the chops mean you just dance until your feet fall off. Chops is... Um how you do something. Maybe it's uh, a trumpet player that plays too hard. Play a horn really hard? Like like you're playing your horn and you played so much that you can't play anymore. Warming up like the mouth, like the Our movements with like a knife and you're chopping up like a chop. I buy it, so I maybe buy like it, one of very these. good. Practice those, practice those fingers, practice those uh, the, the gems, practice the gems. Hands, chops, chops. When you like hit each other like that. When you're training and boxing, there's pork chops hanging from the ceiling. There's you're in a you're in a giant walk-in freezer, and you just, you know, you, you get you get in there. Yeah. Well, this is all about pork chops, and uh, you have to take the you have to beat it really hard before you before you cook it. When you order pork chops, and then your your um, the triangle instrument chops it up. When mom screams to you to take out the pork chops from the fridge in 1947. Hey, Sally, beat up the chops. That's playing the drums. Beat up the chops. Johnny? Eating? Uh, that's when you slap each other in the ass. Bust your conk. Ah, uh, sounds, sounds like a cymbal crash. When you're super drunk and you fall and you on your face. Just don't sit on a chair too hard. God, if I had a dollar for every time someone wanted me to do that, I'd I have can't. three dollars. Three dollars. Look, it was the late 90s. I needed the money. It's not, uh... <laughs> wow. I thought you only did that in the bedroom. That sounds like it's rated X. That's some kind of crazy dance move. Very, very virtuosic. Bust a conk out there on the floor. Dancing hard and you hit your rear end. Is that like an old-timey version of twerking? On first, you're going to... Uh, take a sledgehammer and crack it open, and then you're gonna take the smallest piece you can find, put it between your lips, and blow as hard as you can, and try not to cut your lips open. Frisking the whiskers. <laughs> Frisking the whiskers. I think it has something to do with your cat. If you're taking a cat through airport security, you're gonna need to check every nook and cranny. <laughs> well, that's cat. Is this cat? I think this had something to do with my cat when I was a kid. Getting your mustache ready for the evening out. When you start doing like a little like. I think that's she what's would do it happening. Because I have whiskers, and yeah, she yeah. Have, like yeah. little like. I think that's a jellical thing that like can't really be defined. I, I can't speak of that in public. Does that mean like a backhand? Is this like uh, is this like frisking uh, the whiskers? Flirting with the ladies, smooching on your best gal. It's when you trim uh, your pubic hair. Mmm. <laughs> Ew. Togged to the bricks. Uh, that's when you go to the bar. Some days, at the end of the day, you just go, Lord. I am togged to the bricks tonight. Drunk out of your mind. Too drunk to stand. That's something about going to the bathroom. That's some like S and M thing. <laughs> I am whipped. <laughs> you are whipped. I'm so You're whipped. Whipped. A carpentry tradition dating back to the late 1800s. Yeah, I've heard of that. In which you stack half the bricks, you sit on the brick wall, someone takes an old timey photo or draws a sketch of you, and then you just continue to build the wall. That's right. Tog to the bricks and the tog to the bricks. It's a very distinct swing move from Germany. Oh, that's about dancing. Oh, it must be when you fall. That like grinding up against a wall. Classic move, uh, big in the 40s. Yeah, show um, us. Se Stephanie actually is the best at the tog. That's opening night on Broadway. I'm just tog to the bricks right now. Slide your jib. Launch yourself on the dance floor and slide across and right up to somebody. Sounds like you. Yeah, Sounds yeah. like what you it's, do. It's, I did at my wedding, actually. I remember, yeah, but I mistimed, I, mis I, I, I misjudged how slick the floor was and actually took my wife out. Slide your jib, slide your jib. I uh, can say it's a Hawaiian guitar phrase. On your phone, and you're, swi you're swiping right or left. Slide, slide your jib, slide, slide your jib. Hey, Carol, we're running late. Would you slide your jib a little, please? I, I can't explain that to you on camera, sorry. I don't think you can say that here. That also sounds like it's rated X. And it probably has something to do with drugs. Like, a, like an arm move, like a jib of a camera, yeah. but like an arm. Slide, <laughs> slide the jib. You do that like this, that's sliding your jib. Hey, let me get a drink, and they slide the drink down the bar to you. When someone has a pork slider next to you, and you're still hungry, you say, boo. Can you slide your jib over here, please? But I'm still hungry. The southern accent is really the key to the whole thing. Well, you know I'm a southern girl. 
But even if you're not, and Thank there's you. there's Thank and you. there's one, you have to say it in a southern accent. Um, Give me your jib. Slide it. Slide your jib on over here.